if somebody would have brought down civilization 100 years ago, we wouldn't have to worry about much about global warming. We wouldn't have to worry about the toxification of the total environment with pesticides. We wouldn't have to worry about dioxin in every mother's breast milk. I mean, how long? You know, at what point? What's the threshold? You know, 100 years from now, it's like we'd still have, you know, name it. We'd still have oceans. Air to breathe. They're not going to give a shit as to whether we voted Democrat, Republican, Green, anarchist, didn't vote at all. They're not going to give a shit as to whether we recycled. They're not going to give a shit as to whether we were violent or nonviolent. They're not going to give a shit as to whether we're nice people or not nice people. They're not going to give a shit as to whether we uh, wrote great books or made great films or did great talks or anything else. They're going to care about whether they can breathe the air and drink the water. You know, we can all fantasize whatever we want about some groovy eco-socialist utopia with free love everywhere. It doesn't fucking matter if you can't breathe the air, you can't drink the water. And the only measure, I mean, it's embarrassing to say this, but the only measure by which any generation will be judged is the health of the land base that they pass on. The needs of the natural world are more important than the needs of the economic system. The needs of the natural world are more important than the needs of the economic system. I have, thanks.